definitely fake the video. Yep. But this train track is CGI, his bus wheels are CGI, his mm -hmm. explosions and his shredder is CGI, his car is digitally moved, his pit is fake, and his guy. city is not a band, buildings are fake. Greetings, greetings, all my dreamers and dreamettes. It's your boy Mickey Fenty, aka Mickey Made It. If you're new to this channel, you ought to do to this channel. Subscribe right now. Today's episode, I wanted to bring this to you guys, and I've been doing a lot of investigation on a lot of people. They miss out on these fine details that make people scam other people. And in this incident, we're talking about an influencer. Today, we're gonna dig into Mr. Beast and see what's really going on. It's genius. Because I seen a uh, news on NBC News. They reported something on Mr. Beast, but the way they told the story, it kind of sounded like they was promoing him. Man, you got me thinking back. And when I thought about it, I said, you know what? Mr. Beast might be in cahoots with these people that's working these streams, this and that. Because when, even when you look into his older YouTube videos, like just punching Mr. Beast's first video, it's some video saying that, you know, in five years I will publish this. You guys got to be very careful about these people out here. The people in hip hop have gathered a lot of attention from the people. So you ha you're going to have content creator plans, music plans. You're going to have people coming in to grab this attention so they can get this free attention from the people. That's a fact. Just for me looking into it, if I had an overview of it, a lot of the stuff that he's saying, first of all, as far as giving away a lot of money like that, number one, I don't know if he came from struggle or where this guy came from, but the amount of money that he's giving away, that's, is that coming from him or a corporation? Number two. How he gave away the money was stolen from a Netflix special that really blew up. And that, I'm going to show you guys the actual. He took the how they tried to make anybody do anything for money. And they just showed highlighted people doing anything for money. Mr. Beast, in turn, took that from their show and he put that into his but he had big production behind the scenes kind of like when he you know set up like anything that you're believing on this youtube and then they say you know he's the top best youtuber this and that mr beast has a custom 50 million subscriber youtube play button he got this today and shared it on twitter and it looks really cool mr beast posted this on twitter and he also put underneath it just kidding this is fake my friend made it for me and i don't know which friend made this for him but they did a really good job really the top best youtubers they don't want them to be the top best youtubers they want to put people in place to be the top you guys pay attention to what's going on man don't stay blind i don't do this for the views i do this for the viewers it makes me wonder what happened here i think that mr beast is platformed on purpose for his friend to be transgender on purpose for kids to ask questions about things they shouldn't even know about on purpose to their parents who on purpose are brainwashed by the universities to tell them that chris is a transgender and it's great on purpose i think this is all on purpose yeah and he's the biggest youtuber of all time yeah. by like way too much yeah. i was not having a good time but we were filming a video so I was trying my best to be funny, you know? I'm, I got, I, I'm a dark comic, you know? I, I, got, I got bits about, I had a very traumatic life. What? You know, so I'm in this situation where I, my, my mental health is not good. What? Okay, so here's the NBC, um, here's the NBC news. He's on the news, so let's check it out. They're always pushing this guy on people. Like, Mr. Beast is getting the, the promo from corporate. Guys, you guys got to pay attention to who's content creators and who's working behind the scenes. I don't know what's up with you guys. Use use your mind, your brains. Talking about Jimmy Donaldson, but you probably know him as this Mr. Beast. This is more like Beast. a promo. You know, the guy with 312 million subscribers. Super duper popular. He's 26. He's got all these videos. Some of them feature these stunts, these big giveaways. That stolen, that whole big money, right? Seven I'll, I'll go because... Okay, here's a good way for me to do it. Like, they did millions that on that of dollars. Show. But there are some folks sounding the alarm after what they describe as a chaotic from? shoot. Do you guys even In a know? TV and streaming exclusive, our Chloe Malas speaks with another YouTube star who's looking to expose what's really behind the scenes of Mr. Beast's empire. 
So this Welcome. is our new well, studio. Like Rosanna Pansino, like one of YouTube's they original and most influential money. content they creators, the host of a popular baking show. And now we're going to do this to the rest of our donuts. Is now speaking out against the platform's biggest star. Jimmy is not the same person that he is on camera as he is off camera. Pansino met Mr. Beast, whose like real name is Jimmy so Donaldson, listen, listen, about five listen, years listen. ago. I have a heart for philanthropy and giving back. What? It's a good trick to try to get him because they see that gossip and things like that are selling and selling products. So they try to put him in like this gossip state. Before it was like this, I'm going to give money away thing. It's all deceiving things. You guys got to pay attention to what's going on in these times. That's a fact. Facts, facts. People want your time and they want to deceive you. And they put people in place to make these this money for people. Pay attention. What is he doing that we don't know as other content creators that do the same thing and he gets better promo than everybody else? There's always some type of new person in place. I remember one time it was Justin Bieber, it was NBA Youngboy, it was all of these people in entertainment. But now it seems like they're cutting the entertainment entertainers off and they're giving this responsibility to content creators. Pay attention to what is going on on social media. Let's get it and that's how he presented himself as a good guy who loves to do charity and likes to make big fun silly on YouTube news. videos. And whichever one of these 456 people survives the longest wins 456 grand. Pansino even went into business with Donaldson, though the ventures failed. But she says everything changed after she appeared on Mr. Beast's 2021 reality competition show, The Creator Games. And the perfect dating place. She was unfairly edited, she says. Number one, these people don't use, it's, these people, we never even seen these people. A lot of times when, when they try to pull these tricks and scams, they usually do it in commercial where it doesn't take too long, maybe 30 second, 20 second, even five second commercials. They try to throw people in there. Sometimes you'll hear a song from a rapper, but like, who was that? What rapper was that? And you don't even recognize the artist. It's because they're putting these people in place so they can bring in their money. It's almost like a Ponzi, but hey, maybe I'm, seeing something different but you guys let me know down below is this whole mr beast thing a scam is he really number one or are these numbers being played with on the daily because i'm seeing more and more promo for mr beast and i don't watch him i see him getting pushed in the news i see him they trying to put him in the same light as they usually do entertainers and they're using the same stories this whole thing is so chat gpt you guys can't fool anybody that has this so until next time it's your boy mickey fenty aka mickey made it if you're new to this channel you know what to do to this channel subscribe right now for the information